what you're doing is you're pushing all the mice and voles and gophers from your house outside, creating that barrier. Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Kevin with The Longest Yard. Welcome back for another one. Today we are at our project lawn, taking care of some mice and mole and varmint problem that's causing lots of tunnels in their yard and bumps in their lawn. So we're gonna take care of that for them. Stick around. Moles, voles, and automobiles. We've got moles. Well, actually they're called voles. And we've got a lot of them in my project lawn. So they're a big issue in the winter especially, so I wanna make sure I get this before we get into winter. Home Depot sells this. It is a all safe, natural for your lawns, good uh, pets, children can be used around them so that's great that's great news because there's kids and dogs here my kids run around the yard you don't want to poison them well, it's made of castor oil that's it other ingredients water soluble little pellets right but castor oil they hate the castor oil it's powdered sugar the lice hate the sugar what you want to do is you want to find their tunnels and it's easy to do in a lawn but i'll show you what they look like Looks like their tunnels go straight to the house. That's not what you want. Another good one. And they're just everywhere. Here's the important part. You start at your house. First day, you do a circle around your house, like a rainbow effect the first day. So you want to spread it out from your house. First day, water it in, good to go. The next day, you go outside of that first strip, rainbow effect, right? Layering it. You go outside of that one, water it in. What you're doing is you're pushing all the mice and voles and gophers from your house outside, creating that barrier. You start at your house, push them out, that is your barrier. It's really that easy. Now these granulars you can put in a spreader or this, this tub actually has a spreader on it. So however big your, your lawn is, now this is 32,000 square feet. So I bought out uh, Home Depot. They only had four in stock. So I actually bought them out, but that's fine. I'll, I'll be able to get this down today, then water it in, then repeat the steps, right? So by this weekend, they should be out in the field where they need to be and not in the lawn. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Ooh, also a good tip to punch holes. You wanna punch holes, dig holes right into their tunnels so that gets down right into where they need to be, where they are, and it drives them out faster. It helps with the um, water solubles to get down into their tunnels a lot faster. Otherwise, it just takes a little bit more time, but that is a great tip. Punch holes right into their thing. That's what she said. <laughs> Okay, this is gonna take way too long. Let's go get with the spreader. rainbow stripe down today I'll get it watered in come back tomorrow the next rainbow stripe day three third rainbow stripe water it in and watch them run out of your lawn into the fields where they belong that should be it thanks guys for watching <sighs> say thanks for watching thanks for watching thank you guys for watching and laters on the menche 
you. And I love you more. <laughs> I love you more than all of See you guys later.